Classic, man. Tavon, you know. Two Light Tay, MVP yeah, and MVP, all that. MVP, finals MVP. Out there cooking, regular, you know. To I, dunks. I didn't see you. I'm not going to lie. I haven't seen you play with that type of passion in a long time, Tay. Facts. I feel like that was your comeback. Like, what was the What was the difference, man? What was the change in the gears? Like, what made, What brought you back to that? Honestly, I moved away from Rockman, and I had a lot going on um, with my life and stuff. Um, okay, that happens. The passion really wasn't there. Mm -hmm. and at that time, I think when I first came back, remember I played with uh, who was I playing on? Um, that Burgundy. I, I played on the bridge. Matt, yeah, you played on the. You did. You you did me a favor. You did the trial package with the bridge. <laughs> it did a workout. Then I think you went to. Then you did the hoops and roses. That jersey's fire, by the way. Hoops and roses was all right. You did good with them, and then they, you know, then you came an OD. What really hurt my feelings was in, um, what, what is that team called again? Rockman's yeah, Rockman's Finest. They, they beat us by like, I don't know. Oh, yeah. But I was uh, like, yeah. like, you don't do that to me. But not like, not Joe, um, to be honest, Joe was like, yo, come play. And I was just like, nah, you know what I mean? Like, I had to get back to myself first. Mm -hmm. But then, um, when Ball Turner came and I seen the teams that was set up, I'm like, all right, well, this is a matchup. That's a matchup. We got to win this. Who knows who's gonna go undefeated, but the bullies. Ooh, <laughs> Yo, I, I like spicy. that. Don't say it. I, don't don't say, say it. it. I got my people really already. Right? Yeah, you know, we play the championship. I can bully everybody else, not the family. Mm. I'm, yo, Cashewitz and Cole, take note to that one too. <laughs> yo, Mecca. Yo, Mecca. <laughs> we the big brothers to the bullies. Nah, nah, I mean. Man. I'm not mad, man. Everybody needs a big brother. And sometimes big brothers got to get suplexed by the little brother to let them oh, know man. it's real sometimes. You know what I mean? So, right. so you know, in the finals, in the finals, there were some things that transpired that, uh, you know, seemed to be in your favor, we'll say. And like that's what? how it went. Like what? us hitting threes. and Y'all hitting threes. We had five players. I had no yeah, point guard. Half your team came late. My, no, I remember my point guard broke his hand when he reached on you. I was playing with a you? bad hamstring. That was my one. And, I was playing on okay, one leg. And then, and Shout then, my cousin too, but and then, and to and then Kimi, what happened with Kimi? So I lost my big but shooter. Why did you what have Kimi on me? I lost... He was killing you. You saw the highlights. How many threes he <laughs> Shout out to Insatiable. Yo, he was killing you. He was killing you. That's my little brother. He was killing you. And then, and he was killing y'all. And then y'all put a hit out on him. <laughs> Listen, <it's>, <laughs> Shout out to Kiwi, yo. Y'all killing nah, y'all. That's my little brother. Yeah, shout out to Kiwi, man. man. That's when he got hurt. He yeah, he got hurt yeah. that game, man. Yeah, it was crazy. Yeah, it was crazy. Yeah. That was a freak accident. We're just playing yeah. around. It, it was yeah. very unfortunate what happened yeah. to him. That was crazy. But obviously, you guys won. But there was a few things that bounced in your favor, but there's no excuses. Trust me. You guys won fair and square. We, mm -hmm. we played the game as we were supposed to play it, and that was that. that was but what, game what I will say right. is, though. Yeah, it was a good game. Big E out of that game. Yeah. That's what changed it. Yes. Big E. Took him out. Big E should have been more aggressive yes. at the time, right. but once I they took kept that charge, the he didn't want to yeah. no more. Yeah, they took him out he the paint. He started shooting jump shots. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean it happens, man. He he has to grow with experience. Mm -hmm. He's he's yet he's to be too. he's yet to be the focal point of our team because we've had some times where we had guards that were more ball mm -hmm. dominant. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna restructure our team to make sure that he's one of the he main focal points. Yeah, he right. You know, be the number one coaching, Brad. We're gonna figure this out. You know, coaching, you, know? you can't over recruit, man. I'm trying to tell yeah. you. Uh oh, uh oh. Wait, Brad, they get that you. Recruit people from the. I knew, I knew was a family yeah. came I'm, here. They was gonna I'm, get that. Maybe I'm talking about. Let's talk about this. Who I recruited? Team is supposed to be the family. Oh, dang. Giorgio's supposed to be the family. Dang. Yo, I mean, y'all gotta do what y'all gotta do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, look, man, I you feel to me? Them, I, you know I, mean? I, I, I played by the rules. I waited no, for the free did, agency. Did. I, wait, I waited for the free agency window. We didn't know Keen was even playing. Then that's y'all fault. How y'all family and you don't check up on family? And that's bars, by the way, brought to you by Brett Bronson. Cheap plug, cheap plug. That's money right there. You know what I mean? So that's all it was. I reached out to Kimi. Actually, you know what really happened behind the scenes? We were talking about building a TBT team. Mm -hmm. That's what really happened. We got we got connected to try to work out something to build a TBT team. And I said, yo, bro, have you been hooping? He said he hasn't been hooping like that, mm -hmm. but he wants to get back. So I said, yo, come over here. You know, take some less minutes. You don't got to do a lot of work. Just come through and mm -hmm. build yourself back. And then he kind of got back. Back when we got into the playoffs, like that's when I feel yeah, like he, started, he finally yeah, started yeah, getting yeah. That's exactly a little rhythm. Yeah, rhythm. yeah, he started rhythm, getting some yeah. rhythm, and then you know, he, he started knocking uh, down uh, three. He was, yeah, and you know, right. when he yeah. was yeah. in his like prime, Oakeen. yeah, in his prime, he's a he's Clay Problem. Thompson. Yeah, you know Problem. what I mean? Like right. he's he a Clay Thompson type. Yeah. But anyway, enough about Keen. We here for the family. You know what I mean? So, Reem, what's going on with you, man? You mighty quiet over there, brother. 
Not much. So what's the new plans, man? Any new plans for the family in the future? What's going on? Waiting on BOH basketball right now, honestly. Okay. Well, psh, we waiting too, man. Your man Cuomo got us <laughs> got us jammed up. We won, we won in every division, every league you put in so far. One day's full. We got to win the summer and then we good. And yeah. we got to win 35. You, won, you definitely won um, my one day's. Twice. Yeah. Twice. All you won two one day's, not all. Because the Bullies did win that one day at Torrin Valley. Did Talk to me nice. Family was not in there, so uh, y'all got scared. That ain't my fault. Oh, so anyway, oh, man, there it is. <laughs> that ain't my fault. I said, I didn't get the memo. They I wanted, they wanted a new champion. Oh. Stop it! Stop <laughs> it! Stop it! I, I sent the bass text. You on the list? <laughs> 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 so you know, you played in uh one day events. You mm-hmm. definitely won some uh, fall league yes. and winter league. Mm-hmm. So what do you think is the issue that's been eluding you guys in the summer? Because you know when we talk off the camera, mm-hmm. I always say, like, the summer's that's WrestleMania. The yeah. the, uh, uh, I don't care about none of those Royal Rumbles. <laughs> I don't care about none of that other stuff. You got to get this one. We never we never came with the full team. The, the yeah. real team. Mm-hmm. Like in your last interview with Ricky, he came late. If we if he came on time, it would have been different. Oh, wait, you were listening. Yeah, tune in. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. So yeah, he did say that y'all came late, got thrashed by the by uh, you know yeah, Palisades exactly. Elite. Yeah, we lost. We paid I'm, them back though. Yeah, yeah. Listen, this is why. This is what back. I like. We gave him the fifty piece special. Mm. This is what I like because what happens is in this league that people don't really understand is how deep <laughs> these mm-hmm. rivalries really oh, this go. Goes, this goes back from. The Spring Valley, yeah, this Spring is Valley like decades. Y'all, y'all beat like us, it. y'all beat us, and took two of our championships. Uh, three, but you know who's counting three? <laughs> three. I don't remember. Two. I just remember two. <laughs> I mean, I know. You know, That's amnesia three? usually happens yeah. when you. I mean, I, I, yeah, Fred had when we when remember. Oh, when I, don't, I don't. Oh, of course. Oh, so remember when y'all counts, bu- when y'all built I mean, up your skate yeah, park? But I don't, remember the skate park up top and big. The skate park that y'all got up top when y'all built. <laughs> that, that <fancy laughs> yeah, yeah, the roller <laughs> rink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The roller rink y'all got up top that y'all built. Rink. That y'all spent your money to build a roller rink in the hood. So anyway, y'all built the roller <laughs> rink. That, that, that and then that summer, Fact. that summer y'all Christ christened yeah. the park. Yeah, and then they told no, me. Right, I, right, I right, never forget. They you told us, yo, y'all, y'all have a straw dudes. Y'all ain't going to leave. It's one way and one way out. Oh, that's crazy. It was crazy threats out there, but it was dope. That's what I'm trying to. That's what I'm trying to. That's the atmosphere. That's what I love about. I'm not going to. I'm not. Discredit anyone else's league, but about this league, the environment. Yeah. Right. Because it Energy really is, is some yeah. never tuck yeah. your town type of right. feel. Because yes. you are rooting for your team, yep. mm-hmm. but at the same time, you're rooting for your town. Yep. Yeah. Right. You know what I mean? So when we had a guy like McKay, he pull up. Mm-hmm. You don't think them dudes that never stepped foot from Clarkstown and all the other places didn't start taking notice? Like, Definitely. oh, yeah, yeah, let's root for this guy. Mm-hmm. Of right. course. That's their putting champion. In work. Yes, he putting was. In work. Putting in work. That's their champion. Havistraw has a champion. Right. You guys have a champion. Yep. Everywhere has their own champion. Champions. Right. There's a lot of basketball history that our towns don't even know, know about, about other towns. Yep. Tap and Z out there winning mad chips yeah. that we don't even right. hear yeah. about. Right. Mad players going to D1 schools yeah. that we don't even know about. Have right. no While idea. We're out here struggling to get to, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah. So I think that what's happening with this league and everybody involved is that we're bridging these gaps. Mm-hmm. Yes. Everybody's yep. starting to understand like there's a lot of talent in Rockland County. Yeah, Facts. you feel me? So now Facts. imagine once we get like some kids to actually stay home, like Ricky McGill. Mm-hmm. That's why Ricky McGill is very important. Mm-hmm. He stayed home. He went D one. D one. He went overseas, Word. and now he'll start his journey. However, it starts and ends. Facts. That's on him. Mm-hmm. But at least he had the opportunity, yep. and Facts. he made it from in town. Yeah. Facts. Imagine how much times Jersey gets credit from dudes that live right across the border. Yo, yeah. infinite. Every every everybody we had all the time. Jer- Jersey claims them, and and that's no knock on Jersey. You know, yeah. y'all doing what. Y'all do like Jersey got some crazy them. hoopers. Yeah, yeah. Jersey got crazy right. hoopers too. But imagine, imagine our Rockland County basketball history if mm-hmm. everybody stayed, stayed here. in yeah. town. Yeah. Facts. If all the kids that went to North Rockland went to North Rockland. If all the kids from Spring Valley either went to Spring Valley or Ramapo. You know what I'm saying? Even mm-hmm. if they chose one of those two schools, who cares? But you know at least you were in town. You know how you fix right. that? Put the right coaches in place. Ooh, that's a fact. That's, that's the another, right coaches in place. Mm, the people that, that that the players are going to respect. Yes. Yeah. That they seen them play. Yes. yes. Put in work. Yep. And they around them all the time. That's exactly. Guys, that's bro. the last thing you said huge. is a key piece. They that's go to practice. Huge. That's the only time they see their coach. Yeah. Facts. That's huge. Come on. So Facts. you think? So you think there's too many dinosaurs? Too many could, guys with name, old credentials that need to be and politics. Spring Valley and Ramapo. Mm. The head coach should be. Joe Paranel. Oh, hold Valley. on. Oh, we doing it. Okay. And K Boy should be the coach oh, okay. at Ramapo. Okay. Facts. Yo, you got to put on. You got to put on Gladiator. Said two you names. Yo, you got to put on Gladiator. Two bro. names. Yo, that's, that's those are two names that yo, you know Mills the young Inc. guys are uh, uh, gravitate to. Exactly. You and know they what still I mean? coach these kids. 
They, they coach him in AAU. Still balling, they too. Ball. And they still play ball. They still play like, ball. yo, Joe those are... were both coached with the Junior Tigers, yes. honestly. Yes, they do. Both 16 U's. And, and K-Boy actually cool. took responsibility for coaching the girls and the men's team as well. Yeah. Mm. He coached my daughter. So that's dope. So wow, we are getting a lot of exclusives yeah, out here on Never Tuck Your Town this, Radio. Yeah, this I like this. That's two, that's two of each of those schools' best players yes. to ever play for them. Yes. Right. That's two of them. So why can't they coach if they already coaching? That's why a fact, are they not bro. head coaches? That's a fact. <laughs> Yo, he's that a, is a great I'm I'm <laughs> bro, usually I, I got it. I'm not gonna lie, usually I got something to say, I'm but I don't know what to bro. say because it's like they can't even give you a reason. They All right, can. what's the reason for such and such being here for so long and they're not still not doing anything? They're not Politics. nobody's even uh they're not even receptive to you. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Like that's the biggest issue. They're not even listening to you. Not even giving like, you Like you go into the games. Right. I go to games and I see coaches. I don't care about like what school, but I go to games and you can tell the kids are not engaged with the coach. Mm-hmm. They don't care about what you have to say. They're not listening to your yeah. message. But what's crazy to me is that I'll see like an assistant coach talk to that kid and his eyes light up. Yep. yep. You know what I mean? Yep. He's retaining information. Yeah. That's but he's it's probably like, in tune. He's probably putting work in with those with kids. Those he guys. probably went to their town where they, yes. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. All that. And that's where the that's where the gap is. Mm-hmm. And this ain't about, once again, this is not about Spring Valley. This is nah, not an attack it happened Spring in Valley. It happened at North Rockland, too. Yeah, right? this just yeah. happens in high school. High school exactly. sports. This just happens in high school sports. Like, you know, the politics of high school sports. It happens. Absolutely. It is what it is, you know. Hopefully, you know, VOH basketball, we sent some kids to college. Hopefully, we could continue the trend and tradition with all the contact that we've been making behind the scenes we've been linking up with some agents so hopefully you know we could send some guys directly from the league overseas so i hope everybody's been paying attention to what we've been building you guys have been here from from the the jump so i can imagine what it looks like to you guys being involved in it Mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying so now imagine when when your kids get older Mm -hmm. and you can you don't even have to think about it now you're gonna play in voh yeah Mm -hmm. voh you're playing for the family you feel me yeah because now y'all already have that labar lavar ball kind of influence and feel now he just opened everybody's eyes they thought he was crazy first yes they thought he was Terrell Harris actually okay Mm. Mm. okay okay talk that talk okay okay talk that talk talk that talk and that's how it gotta be man you know shout out to Sean Coleman too I never played in a Sean I never played in a Sean Coleman tournament I don't even know who Sean Coleman is but I see so many Sean Coleman shirts in my life I'm being dead honest and I you know I played in everything or I tried to but I never even got a chance to play in Sean Coleman but he branded that so well and so so many kids had shirts all over the county that it was like who is you know, this guy? Where, you know first of all, right. if, if Sean Coleman, if you're out there, holla at me. Nah, I think Sean Coleman, wasn't he a kid that died? He got like, hit by a car. I'm not oh, but I mean, oh, who, yeah. whoever's involved, think, in, that, involved in that, whoever was involved in that. it had already started. Okay. Uh-huh. Oh. I think, I think oh, that's dope. Was. I didn't know it was yeah. to keep I didn't a, even know that. a young that's kid's dope. name alive. That's what's up. Yeah, Sherry. Yeah, Sherry, Sherry okay, so okay. I'm gonna holler at Sherry McGill, try to get some history on that, cause yeah. I promise you, I didn't know. I would see Sean Cone. Yeah. I thought Sean Cone was just a famous ball player from Spring Valley that That's had what a lot I of influence. Too, yeah. I thought he was I like Gary you. Coleman. Yeah. I mean, like yeah, Seth yeah, Joyner, like, like, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it's like, yeah like that. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't even know. So you know, shout out to that. That's a good movement that y'all started out here. So y'all been, y'all been trudging. Y'all been doing this. Yo, so I got a question for y'all. That's what's up. Because we talked about earlier, like, a lot of people being from Rockland and their stories not being told. Um, now that we got these these young men behind the camera making movies, yeah, um, would y'all be down to do, like, a documentary where we really tell these basketball stories oh, yeah. and really just bring some yeah, light to definitely. what's going on behind the scenes? Because I think that would be big for the league and big for everybody else's oh, yeah, individual definitely. brand, you know? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Speaking of, speaking of stories, speaking of stories, shout out to my man Bruce Wayne. We was out in Long Island. And uh, we talking, having a good time. Uh, and uh, his man jumps in talking basketball. So I'm like, you know me, I'm like, what? You know? So I'm like, all right, so who's the best players to ever come out of Long Island? Mm-hmm. Let me hear it. So he goes, Tobias Harris and Tavon Sledge. I said, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Hold on I now. I said, whoa. <laughs> like, calm down. I said, say that in what name again? That's he our said, guy. Tavon Sledge. That's he said our guy. Co- he said it with confidence uh-huh. to me. <laughs> so you know the battle rapper. Like, oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, you feel me? I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, hold on. Tavon Sledge from Rockland County. Spring Valley. <laughs> Spring Valley, you know. He was like, 
no, no way, no way. How did he play? I said, when you're nice, <laughs> things yeah. happen. Yep. Pretty you know, much. so so tell these guys out here, no knock to them, because shout out to Crunch Time, because they yep, busted our nose up. Yep. You know, so we're going to get them back. You already know. We got family, dogs out there. The family versus Crunch Time. Oh, the family versus Crunch Time? We the, Make we it the personal? We the hired assassins. Ooh. I like that. I like that. Yo, White. You heard it here heard first. It here first. All right. The All right. family wants crunch the time. The family versus crunch time. We setting it up. Team 57, you know, we sorry took about it. Took care of y'all, you know. <laughs> on to the we next challenge. Avenge, we had to avenge the town. Mm. Uh-oh. Yo, yo, not for nothing. Yo, Uh-oh. Tay was old. Teeing when he when he was playing in uh, half hollows. No, so I lived in I lived in Long uh-oh. Island back then, right? Talk to him. So I hit Quam up on Facebook and I'm just like, yo, I, I see Tay's schedule, whatever, whatever. I want to come through. He's like, Z, get here early, like yeah. early. Yeah. So I'm like, all right, <laughs> I go there, I go there 40 minutes, whatever. Mm-hmm. Yo, this joint was first of all, there's a crowd outside the gym. Yep. Standing room only in People the gym. I go inside. Yeah, on the. Oh, wait, wait. It's crazy. Wait, before before college, you do that, nah, before high school, before oh, you do that, when he played with Tobias Harris. Before yeah. you oh, do that, yeah. so the guy that I was talking to said the same thing. So he says to me, and this is how you know he's an old dude. He said, "Yo, it's so crazy inside that nobody could get inside. Mm-hmm. Everybody was standing outside, and there ain't no windows. It's <laughs> crazy. It didn't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> it did. Yo, you know what it looked like. We can hit the game. We can hit it. Yo, man. yo, you know what it looked like. You know, in the NBA, when your team goes to the finals and at the arena, they still yeah. have the yeah. joint playing. It was like. That yeah, with no crazy. screen outside, yo, that's it was crazy. crazy. So I pull up and I'm like, yo, this is nuts. That's so crazy. then, yo, him and th- these dudes are going, they're going crazy, like mm-hmm. dunk after dunk. Yeah. Tay is catching mad bodies. Tobias is going crazy. Like it was just, yeah, Tobias is younger brother. Yeah, tell, it was ridiculous. Tyler, tell Tobias to check in though, man, because uh, you know what I'm saying. It seems like Tay helped your career, so uh, oh, it's a lot of assist that he gave you that uh, you, ain't, <laughs> you ain't paying back for. So pull up to the league one game. That's all you gotta do. We ain't, yeah, ain't talking about no money. Yeah. Just pull up one day, walk through. That's all. You should have asked right. the dude who got the um, most points in the playoffs game in Long Island. That's, That's Tay too. At Hofstra, you got the most playoff That's points. That's crazy, yeah. That's Yo, dope. Tay, you too modest, man. You got a lot of yeah, accolades, bro. 46. Oh, like 46. Yeah, I, 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 I put in the work. Playoff. Like 46 yeah, you did, in the playoffs. Bro. Yes, you did. I man. like 46 and I in guarantee the playoffs. It, it was light, though. Only two, two, two threes. That's what I was yeah. just about to say. I guarantee you was at the right, rack for though. over half of them. Points. Only two yeah. threes. Yo, that's a lot of work, bro. Yo, the man was beasting. Yeah. And the crowd, it was packed. Mm-hmm. And, it was, and it's loud in there. Yeah. It's loud. This, this man was beasting in high school. And that's why I said earlier those 300 gladiator workouts yeah. that he was yep. doing. Facts. Yeah, at the time, maybe. Facts. Maybe you didn't understand, but that's what it was for. Definitely didn't. That's what it was for. Those you big know. moments, those mm-hmm. big games when you in them line dens and it's you and, you and those 12 guys, and yep. that's it. You know what I mean? That's what those moments are for. So, yeah. And even to take it a step back, yo, because that's what's up. I went, to the, I went to your games in Iona, too. Mm-hmm. Yo. Oh, this guy got game, bodies everywhere. Come on, bro. <laughs> yo. So, the, just to be on the floor and to be able to play at that speed, because I'm looking at the game and I'm like, yo, there's no way mm-hmm. that I could keep up. Like, it's Tay is doing yeah, 90 miles of, a, 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 an hour up the court. And that's just the pace of the game, and he's mm-hmm. still in control. And I'm like, yo, I would have lost the ball. Like, for this real. is crazy. Too so, light, Tay. Well, Iona, they play at that pace, though. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right. So, you know, when I did transfer, it, it, it fit me. It was perfect. Mm-hmm. I mean, right. um, of course, the people I was playing with, like uh, Momo Jones. He was a beast. He was a beast. He was a beast. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? So, you Thomas played with some real guys, man. Mm-hmm. A lot of people. Bro. Other than Tobias, because obviously he's an NBA player, is there anybody else you could name drop that was a real crazy killer that you played with that was just like, damn? Tamir Jackson. Mm-hmm. Mm. I can. Go ahead. Into the mic, please. Play, play, play with or against? Or does with, both, against? Both, no matter. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Encountered. Kimba. Kimba, yeah. You, know I mean? okay. you played against Kimba? What? He played with him, too. With him, against him. Wait, where are we? I know y'all yeah, was going at it. That's Watch dope, it. yo. That's dope. I met Kimba before the draft, though, at a party. Like, it was uh, my man. Yeah, we got the picture. We uh, met him before the party, and he was telling me, I promise you, we we was chilling, and he was like, yo, it would be crazy if I get drafted with Jimmer. That backcourt would be sick. And Mm -hmm. then we took a picture. Me, him, Jay Will, a few other guys from that time period. That's That's crazy. Who else? Kyrie. Mm. Wow. Kyrie, AAU days. Wow. So, Tay, you got some. Yeah, a lot of people. Tristan Thompson I played with. Samardo Samuels I played with. 
Uh, Mike Poole, everybody knows him. Yeah. Aaron Brown. I mean, it's a, you used it's to a ball long with J.R. Smith. JR, yeah, I, I practice with him a lot too. Tell Jr. he need to pull up. He right across the way, man. For Tell real, him to bring yeah. that Jersey team out here so they can get washed too. Mm. We get a lot of love. You, you don't know, man. Sean Kilpatrick shows love all the time. Word. Right? That's what's up. That's what's up. It's a lot of people from on that side that show us love. That's what's up. That's what's up. Matter of fact, getting them over. You know, well, we can go there first. And yeah, then. you know that. Uh, yeah, yeah. You yeah, know yeah, that. We'll work it out. Yeah, we ain't worried about that. We'll pull up. Yeah, you know it's. I played with a lot of people. I, I done seen all types of mm -hmm. sides of the game, mm -hmm. being on the bench, starter, role player, whatever it is. But, um, you know, I'm just grateful to be able just to live it. Yeah. Do it. Right. That's um, what's up. Know, That's what's up. I know man. there's a lot of kids that, that watch or they assume a certain thing is going to happen the way it, and everything doesn't happen the way it is, but just mm -hmm. keep That's working. Fight. Mm -hmm. Right. Yo, so Tay, when was the time, because we were talking to Ricky earlier, and we were talking about a time where he really had to, like, lock in, zone out. Like some Mamba mentality type stuff. So where's a time where you were like that? Good question. And um, you really had to turn up. Where and, you and locked in. Word. Like I need to, I need to show them who I am. I want to say my senior year in high school uh -huh. without Tobias. Okay. Mm. Um, his brother transferred out, so it was me and uh, Mark Jackson's nephew. Okay. And um, a couple of my teammates. You know, we had a, a nice, solid team. But this is the first time when I see my game change because I was playing the point guard with Tobias. Uh -huh. Then the next year, my coach actually moved me from the point to, to the, the wing. Point. Yeah, mm. so, yep. So, so you're Westbrook before Westbrook. Pretty guess, much. Yeah. He was, There's yeah. There's no I guess. Nah, you, you were, bro. Pretty you much. Westbrook. Yeah. That's crazy. He was to the rack just like, yo, yeah. it's crazy yeah. you say that. He yeah. was to the rack yeah. just Dude, like that, that yo. Once, once you bro. said it like that, once yeah. you put it into that perspective, one, that's it. You were 100% Westbrook. Yo, you got to pull them them highlights out, yo. You I were OD, bro. Yeah, well, well, since you got a lot of highlights and we're wrapping up this show, where can they find these highlights? Yeah. Uh, Possibly yeah, on um, your new page? Oh yeah, we do got a, a team page, the VOH the family. Uh, mm. at Shout VOH to them. The family. Yeah. Um yeah, we got a lot of things coming. Uh Family Fridays coming too where you got uh -oh. to know our players. Um uh -oh. the accolades where they That's came from, up. you know. Talk that business talk. Talk that yo. talk. Ooh. Yeah, we got a lot of things in the works right now. We try to get some, you know, merch going on, you know. Okay. Yeah, I'm Just proud of y'all guys, yo, for man. real. Branding and yo, all that. Big, yo, I'm proud of you. Yo, shout out to the family, man. Shout out to the family. Give y'all last shout outs because we, you know, we yeah, did a little OT today. We did a little OT. Yeah, talk so to the people. So give y'all shout outs and let's uh, get up out of here. Mills Inc. Let me start it off. Yeah, go ahead, Mills Inc. Don't shout get crazy, though. First, I'm going to shout out y'all. Appreciate it. Thank us you. On the, on the podcast and everything y'all doing, MOR, everything. Shout out to all three of y'all. Thank you, Even brother. Even the guys behind the camera, shout out to y'all, too. Insatiable Productions. appreciate what y'all doing, not only for us, but for everybody, everybody in the community. Right. Appreciate um, that. I also want to give a shout out to my kids. Yes, you already know. Family first. Word. Yeah, definitely. And just everybody. You know? Girls Rockland, League coming man. soon. Girls League coming soon. Oh, Girls yeah. League coming soon, John. What age, what age group? Uh, what age group you got? I got my sister. She's in college. And I got my, my daughter. My daughter's 13. Oh, perfect. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. We're going to do teams. I'll only show y'all girls. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> y'all sick of this guy. Next, yo, next. Um, I'm <laughs> shout out the founder of the family, my father, obviously. You know, yeah, that's a fact. Shout out to Quan. Shout out to Quan. Uh, JB, Sherry, um, what? I'll say Tony. Well, you know, even the rest. Yeah, yeah man, definitely. Shout out to Tony. Yeah, everybody got a part in it. You know, it might not be a big role, but everybody has a part in it. Um, our players that that continue to stick with us through the years. We know other people's in their heads, like Brad, trying to get them in the slide. Over. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 shout out to Say La Vie. Hey, doing the off season. Yeah, got to do what you got to do. Shout out to Say La Vie. So, yeah, shout out to Say La Vie. We got a lot of things coming around, man. That's what's up, Canada man. Vell. Everybody, I like, you know, everybody's doing their own thing. Yeah. They're trying to, trying to build. Yep. You know what I mean? Facts. Should all build together, man. Yeah, yeah. Cool. definitely. True. Reem, what's up, 5-5? Five, five? <laughs> Shout out to my family, my daughter. Okay. Shout out to John and Tate for bringing me on to the family. Mm. Call me for let me take this role. Let John say shout out to y'all for everything y'all done for us. Appreciate yeah. you, appreciate man. you, Reem, man. I, and I'm and I really do appreciate the talks we do have. You know when we get a chance to speak, cause uh. You know, you, you're a very knowledgeable person, man. Minus how all these people be talking crazy you on the court. I'm just saying, though, you know, you stole my man Johnson respect. Ah, right, yo, turn this guy's <laughs> mic off, y'all. Yo. yo, we out of here, man. Got a love breeze, man. <laughs> Shout out to the family for coming through. See y'all next man. week. Next week. Peace. Word. <laughs>